Good morning, everybody. This is Mike from my scroll room. Okay, what I got now is I got a little stress train. Um, some of my plants, so my other ones are, that were a week later can catch up. And I only got a couple more to go, and they're all caught up. So I also want to talk about low stress training versus high stress training. So whenever you gently bend the stem over, gently bend it over, do no harm to the stem or the limb that's called low stress training now if I was to sit here and work this with my thumb and actually break down the cells you'll hear it popping like bubble wrap so when you actually do that you're damaging the plant and that's called high stress training which is also called super cropping so high stress training is you're actually damaging the plant fibers the plant stem so there's the difference between high stress and low stress I'm just gonna low stress train this one I'm just gonna gently bend it to open up some bud sites but I, I want to bend it towards the back wall so the very first thing I'm gonna do is what no not that take another guess no no not that yeah that's it I'm going to get the base tied off. So when I pull in the opposite direction, it doesn't try and pull the root ball up. There's not that much tension. It's just something I do out of, uh, just in case. I like to count for our, just in case it happens. All right. So far, so good. Now, these big limbs or leaves here, I don't need. And all you people comment about, oh, you don't do that, you're killing the poor plant. Here's what I had to say I opened up a bunch of bud sites right then. And uh, that's what it's all about. At the end of the day, it's about getting more bud sites. That's it. And I had to do it. whatever you got to do, you do it. This leaf needs to go. Now, I'm bending it this direction. So I've got, this leaf is in the way, I need to put in another tie, and thanks for all the new subscribers, I'm over a thousand, and I finally caught up with the comments as of 30 minutes ago anyway, so I'm doing my best guys, but please keep commenting. Uh, it's because of you is why I'm over a thousand viewers it's not me it's you guys you guys made me the channel that it is right now and hopefully it continues to grow so right now I'm kind of limited on content because I'm in between grows uh, and I, I've got the big tent going and all I've got going on on that right now is low stress training some high stress training but right now we're just doing low stress training so I'm, I will do another video later today I'm going to start some seeds, and I'm going to show you how I do it. Got that? All you people out there that want to sit and, and make comments about, oh, you got to put it in water for 24 hours or soak it for 12 hours or do this or do that, that's fine and dandy. I'm going to show you how I do it, all right? And, yes, every seed of mine goes in earthworm castings only, and I've had a 100% germination rate. So we'll just throw that in as a little caveat. That's the big word of the day, caveat. All right, we're going to bend her over gently. I'm going to get below the stem so I don't injure the flyer sites. There we have it. Now you can see this is so thick. Let's bring it in a little bit. Well, it won't. It won't come in. Oh, anyway, you can see it's close to that size. It's probably the size a little bit bigger than a number two pencil. So it will not. I'm not going to super crop it. I don't want to do that. I'm just bending it. Uh, 
and I want to get this one bent over just a hair more so this one I am super cropping I can feel as, I, as I'm pinching it I feel it popping you see that so now that is high stress training I actually damaged that stem so here's what we're going to do to keep it down I'll use the tie that's there already go around it alright so now I've accomplished what I want to do I got the stem pulled over first by low stress training because it's so thick then I super crop this, I high stress train this area, smash it together, bend it over. So now all these bud sides here are open. Remember the big fan leaves were above them? So now this is going to come and turn. I've already topped it. It'll turn and be just like this in a couple of hours. So it'll be the same height as this. So there you have it. There's low stress training versus high stress training. And I hope you learned a little bit there. Uh, and that's how I do it and I have the on 420 don't forget about that giveaway Morris Hydro will send you a 2x2 two two tent directly to you they do ship to Canada someone asked me that they do ship to Canada plus other countries I have a list of the countries but I just don't have it in my head I'm going to throw in a TS 1000 now if it costs me $100 to ship it to Canada uh, you're not getting it so it depends on the shipping I'm going to because I'm going to throw in a TS 1000 of my own so the person has a good start on a good grow tent there they'll have the 2x2 two two tent plus the TS 1000 so you know I, I, I shipped it light yesterday it was 17 bucks I don't mind that but if I got to go with Canada and it cost me arm and leg ain't happening so anyway I love you guys but you know there's a limit so there's the uh, latest video, low stress training with high stress training, open up bud sites, level the canopy, and we will see you on the next video. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, ring the bell. I love your comments. And remember, I'm going to take the, all my contest winners are coming from the comment list. Random draw. So, you guys take care. Have a great day today.